Hello and welcome back. This is Jonathan Carter playing EU4 as Najd. Going for the Jihad achievement. It crashed. So some of the things that I just did are undone. Let's make that core there. These two I think are converting right now. I'm getting up here ready to attack Yarkan. They have a level 8 mothballed fort. I don't know. There's a capital right there. Um, so I just declared... I have not declared war on them yet. <clears throat> they had a mothballed fort that I'm going to make a run for. Uh, these two dudes... Sorry. Stop building troops after I capture you. That's just rude. Okay. Um, let's unpause. We have some free diplomats. I'm not going to give you trade. Um, I don't know why you're asking for that. Yeah, I'm not going to give you trade, man. In fact, I better... Have I canceled the trade? Yeah. Okay, so Darfur. We're going to move into Darfur and take that. We're sieging this fort up there. Um, the goal is to get a path here so I can colonize and get into West Africa and take a territory here, which I think is already Sunni. So I just got to take it. I don't got to convert it or nothing. Um, I am at, as of right now, I am at 260 provinces. A little bit more than halfway. I need to move a little faster. We're running out of time. I don't think I'm going to make it. We'll see, though. We'll see, though. Okay, so move my troop up there. Okay, that... Yeah, you beat the natives. Good job. Okay. Declare some wars. Take your capital. Maywar will join. Alright. Let's go take that fort. Let's see if we can get there in time. Your capital's right there. Let's get the... Uh, this guy's have a lot. Let's move him here. Let's like, move him out of the way. Let's move you. I'm going to tie you up. Let's just start sieging things down. Let's take a look at what the army looks like. All right, that's... They have 18, 19,000. They have nothing. 7,000 is right there. He has maintained it now, so we'll go here instead. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Sometimes... It's a level 2 fort. More natives, yay! Let me get your capital. Okay, so for you, I want these three provinces. That's the wrong guy. For you, that's 27 war score. That would be 73 war score with 73.8 over extinction, which I have too much over extinction right now. So I have to be careful about that. That could be really bad. I do kind of want to, I do still want to smash you. Let me smash your army. Okay, I got that fort. Take that fort. You guys are just annoying me. Where are you going to? Katahar? Alright. So we've got the colony done. Is that what that means? Yes. We have to core it. We start colonizing out here. Uh, nope. Let's 
So we take a look at the wars over here. Yeah, not even a contest. Another stack wipe. That means they have no troops. Well, they, they raised a horse somewhere. Let's actually have you go wipe that horse. Because horses can be annoying too. Okay, see that war? That was nice. Let's go ahead and Still waiting on some missionary work, I believe. We've got a claim on Tibet. Right here, this province. Hungary. Okay, we're sieging that down. Let's siege that back. Fort's gonna fall here any minute. I got their capital, Darfur. Okay, let's piece these guys out. No, these guys. Let's clear off. Her. I don't want too much. I just want these and this one. That's 34 war score. The 14 aggressive expansion, 34 overextension. Um, 34 plus 50, that'll be fine. That'll be fine. So let's go ahead. Anything else that you can give me? Become a vassal. I need some, uh, no, they're not going to do that. That might be good to spend some diplo points to integrate them rather than... No, I'm just going to take it, take it. Fudge. I believe this is already no nope, this is the wrong religion um, but we're gonna core it as quickly as we can because that's important let's raise autonomy and let's start a colony you get up there you don't need this fort we don't need those sneaking forts. All right. Let's just make sure I didn't do something super stupid. Nope, 90.6 force score, or overextension. No, you stay here. You stay here. Yep, slavery is not allowed. Alright, there we go. Another core came in. Thirty-three percent chance of one of these or yeah. The screen's jumping around. I have three free diplomats. Uh, what to fabricate a claim on? Let's just start doing job work. Fabricate a claim on that. Um, you can hurry up and do that really quick here. I'd appreciate that. Where are you going?
Okay, two free diplomats. Let's go fabricate on Lithuania, I think. Wants me to take this idea. I'm not going to do that. Um, how are the armies looking? Is it time to attack Ottomans? It might be soon. I have twice, no, not twice. I have a significant chunk more than the Ottomans. And uh, I carry much more artillery. They have a lot more infantry. Um, but I do so want to smash the minions. I'll have to alternate between smashing those two guys. Fort. raise autonomy? I did not. Okay, you. We are going to siege down this one. Stay there. I'll join you. Let's dance. Wait, I got the capital. Okay, so siege that back. Level up um, Miltech. Uh, should I hold off on it and just... I have 800. I can finish off those ideas. Let's just finish it off. What kind of uh, policies can we get now? Trade efficiency, goods produced, land power, projects, land maintenance modifier minus 10%. Yeah, what is my mission, by the way? Oh, I'll have 2,300 ducats, huh? Oh, you keep fighting those, those dudes too, huh? What are these guys? It's just two. I have two as well. Well, he has a leader, so I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. You go ahead and join this guy. Yeah, I could lose this achievement because I haven't grown fast enough. That'll be annoying. We have uh, 80 years left. got a siege done there. There's the siege. I think that's enough to get the provinces that I want. This is Hindu. Let's go siege that next, actually. 
Let's have you go smash them. John Puris and Barhek up there, and Maywadis and Shekwara. He's heading over to Nagwar trying to pick up my one stack. Let's see if the one stack can stand up to 5,000 without a leader. Probably not. No, nope, he lost. But I smashed him good. You want a Maywar, huh? The autosave is annoying. Okay, we have lazy dips. Fabricate on Lithuania. I think I'll smash Scandinavia, let Ottoman do most of the work. But he's falling over, holy cow. Gain piety, lose piety. Bye bye piety. So I have 99 war score. Uh, and there's a, one more province I need to... A couple more provinces, actually. Please say I have cores in these. Or claims, at least. I think I claimed everything. So just this one. No problem. We'll have peace soon. Don't worry. Take it. Come on. There you go. All right. What is my overextension? It is 46%. Let's wait for that to tick down. Hmm. Let's do this war with the Yarkand. Twelfth of January, seventh of January, you die.
Actually, you know what? Hold on. You stay here. Oh, too bad. Too bad. He's probably going to ask for access. Let's get you out of here. I think all of you guys belong to him. If not, we'll adjust it. This may be the last time I improve relations with you. Alright, no longer claim North Konkan, huh? Where's North Konkan? Is that in China? not good. What do you need? 30 troops? And what's the force limit here? 36? And you need how many cannons? You need uh, 25 and you have 15, so let's send 10 cannons up there. Do you guys have 10 cannons to send? Where's the next war? Let's go uh, Switzerland, or no, this guy. What is he called? He's called a Scandinavia. That's what he's called. Let's go beat him up. Looks like we got some uh, rebels down there. They're gonna ruin everything. Uh, he just got some more troops. We gotta keep smashing him, huh? Fort defense or siege ability? Siege ability. Absolutely siege ability. There's some more separatists here. What kinds are these? These are the Chagatai separatists. Our natural scientist has died, so we need to buy a new one, huh? Missionary strength plus two. That sounds good. Of course, I don't really have much of a choice now, do I? Okay, level up a tech. Is that admin tech? I'm not leveling that up. Although it's tempting to get to level 27. I'm going to need a lot of admin points. Yay! You are attacking my army. No, I'm not going to give you trade power. Holy cow. I'm not your junior partner anymore. I'm your senior partner. Take an idea and what? Without this tolerance of the true faith, I don't want that. Alright, what do we got? 80% the Maywadis. Man, stop raising armies. Can I raise some troops? I have 110 force limit. Holy cow! Let's get this achievement first, this mission first. And when my uh, overextension drops down, it's zero now, isn't it? Excellent news. Cavalry cost goes down. Okay, let's go ahead and do the peace treaty now. So I'm going to take these two from Nepal. 
I'm going to take all the border provinces because I think I have claims on all of them. Ah, shoot. I need to go have a little party here. Looks like uh, Ming spit out somebody else, huh? Lithuania is no longer a valid rival. Holy cow, who's my valid rival then? Alright, now we can have some peace. Peace in our time. That's 125 war score and the 85 overextension. Um... What can I do without? Let's do without some of these. 94, that looks good. Oh, also, you know what I need to do? Need to cancel your treaties. Uh, no, 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 no. Here, I need to do a separate piece. This is going to cost a lot of Diplo points. That's too much, isn't it? Yeah, and besides, I need you to basically not have any treaties, any alliances, and you're not going to give that to me for what reasons? Demands exceed war score. Well, how many war score do you want me to get against you? Okay, is that enough war score for you now? Okay, pause. Okay, let's do it again. Sue for peace. Clear offer. We're just going to ask for no treaties so we can eat you up later. And we especially don't want Vijayanagar. Then we want to get a better border with Vijayanagar. We're just going to keep going until you don't want to give me anything more. 97, huh? Let's do that then. Um... You give me that? No. Okay. That's going to cost 108 Diplo points, which I have. Okay, pause there. Let's go to Nepal. You give me those two things. And that's all that I want. I should have done the Nepal treaty through Nepal. Anyway, yeah, thank you, Nepal. It's been a pleasure. Um, let's get rid of that fort. It's just a silly fort there. All right, autonomy. Autonomy. And let's do all the autonomy here. Raise, 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 raise. Okay. Now, conversions first. That will. I don't know what the right order it is to do things, but. Alright. That was a fun little battle. Let's keep you down here. You're, you're 654. Yeah, let's we'll just keep you down here. Okay. Meanwhile, you are can't. Let's get an army here. What is you? 9, 6, 15. You're a 15 stack. You can't get down there, can you? Hey, Ming, I know you hate me, like, more than anything else in the entire world. But could you be a darling and give me military access through your provinces? Or do I have to declare war on you? Hmm. My mission is to get 2300 bucks. And the reward is 10 prestige. You know what? It's not worth it. Let's build a little bit of an army up here. There's one. There's two. That's going to bring me up to 269. And once I get those done, let's see, Scandinavia, how do you rate? Here, let's see what your allies are first. 
I think it's time to take a break, but let me just look at your allies. Teutonic Order and Austria. Austria kicked Bute against the Ottomans. Lithuania, you are allied with Teutonic Order and Austria. Holy cow. Is Ottomans at war with somebody? No, they're not. Just looks like they are, because they have rebels. Well, should I attack Ming? 150,000 versus my 208,000. I have 60,000 on the way. You know what, Ming? I think it's time. I think it is time. Where is Shekwadi? It's over there. Yeah, let's get you up over that direction too then. Let's actually get you sitting on Shekwadi. Let's bring you guys away from Europe. If I can distract your attention for a minute. Let's see where all my armies are. You stay here. All right, I think that's a good way to wrap up the episode. Next is Ming. Maybe Tibet first. They're allied with Ava. Ava is annoying. This is to Ming. You have no allies. Although we could do Oirat again. Or we have a treaty that. No, we don't have a treaty. They're still allied with Japan. Japan is not my ally. They still are my ally, huh? Okay, let me just look at this really quick. What would happen? Korea would not join. Japan would not join because I already have a war. Anyway, I'll take a break and continue this later. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.